The tube on the left contains the saturated hydrocarbon cyclohexane. The tube on the right contains the unsaturated hydrocarbon cyclohexene. First, brown-red bromine is added drop by drop to the left-hand tube containing saturated hydrocarbon. As the bromine is added, it dissolves in the cyclohexane. The color remains when the solution is stirred because bromine does not react with saturated hydrocarbon. Now, liquid bromine is added to the unsaturated hydrocarbon, cyclohexene. The red-brown color disappears as the bromine mixes with the cyclohexene. This is because the bromine reacts with cyclohexene, adding to the double bond. This reaction is a very convenient test for the presence of a double bond in a molecule.